Airplane engines are powerful machines that make flight possible. These engines are marvels of modern engineering, designed to withstand extreme conditions and deliver consistent performance. They are like the heart of the airplane, providing the thrust needed to push it forward. Without these engines, the massive metal bird would remain grounded, unable to soar through the skies. Have you ever looked out the window of an airplane before takeoff and noticed the engine spinning? It's a mesmerizing sight, a reminder of the intricate machinery at work. These engines are incredibly complex, but we can break down the process of starting them in a simple way. It begins with a series of checks and balances, ensuring everything is in perfect order. Imagine turning the key in your car, but on a much larger scale. The principles are similar, but the execution is far more sophisticated and grand. There are several steps involved, beginning with preparations in the cockpit. Pilots meticulously follow protocols, checking instruments and systems to ensure a smooth start, and culminating in the roar of the engines. This powerful sound signifies that the engines are ready and the airplane is set to embark on its journey through the skies. Before starting the engines, pilots have a detailed checklist to follow. This checklist is crucial and covers every aspect of the aircraft's readiness. This comprehensive checklist ensures that everything is ready for a safe startup. It includes checking the aircraft's systems, instruments, and controls. Pilots meticulously check the fuel levels, making sure there's enough for the entire flight, including reserves for unexpected situations. They also make sure the wings and control surfaces are set properly. This involves inspecting the flaps, ailerons, and rudders to ensure they are functioning correctly. One of the most important steps is communicating with the ground crew. This communication ensures that all ground operations are coordinated and safe. The ground crew helps guide the airplane out of the gate and make sure the area around the plane is clear of any obstacles or hazards. Once the pilots get clearance from air traffic control, they can begin the engine start sequence. This is a critical moment, as the engines power up and the aircraft prepares for taxiing and eventual takeoff. Most large airplanes use something called an APU, or Auxiliary Power Unit, to begin the engine start process. This small but mighty component is essential for getting the aircraft ready for flight. The APU is a smaller engine located at the back of the airplane. It might not look like much, but it plays a crucial role in the overall operation of the aircraft. It provides power to start the main engines. Without the APU, the main engines would struggle to get going especially when the aircraft is on the ground. Think of it like a jump start for the airplane. Just as you might use jumper cables to start a car with a dead battery, the APU gives the main engines the boost they need to start. The APU generates power for electricity and also provides air, called bleed air, to start the engines spinning. This bleed air is crucial because it helps to turn the engine turbines, getting them ready for ignition. The pilots then turn on a switch that sends electricity to the engine igniters. This is a critical step in the process, ensuring that the engines receive the necessary power to ignite. This is like the spark plug in your car. Just as a spark plug ignites the fuel in a car engine, the igniters in an aircraft engine serve the same purpose. The igniters create a spark that ignites the fuel and air mixture in the engine. This combustion process is what ultimately powers the aircraft's engines, allowing them to generate thrust. With a powerful roar, the engine comes to life. This sound is a clear indication that the engines are ready to propel the aircraft into the skies, marking the beginning of another journey. Interesting facts. Did you know that some airplanes have auto start sequences? This means the computer can help start the engines automatically. However, pilots are always monitoring the process to make sure everything runs smoothly. Another cool fact is that the process for starting an engine can vary slightly depending on the type of aircraft but the general principles remain the same. You need electricity, a way to spin the engine, and fuel to ignite.